Okay, everybody. Welcome to Sunday. Uh, it's the first day of National Sewing Month, and I am here with my live feed, and I'm attempting to get this thing going for the very first time, and I apologize if I'm having some technical issues here, but um, this is my first time, and I've got this third-party software that I have to use. So this is kind of new for me. So um, just bear with me. It's kind of, you know, learn as you go over here. So today we're going to be looking at the Swatch Club from Mood Fabrics for August 2019. And I thought it might be fun to do this live so that for those of you watching, can ask me questions if you have any questions about how the fabric, like particularly how does it feel, things like that. So let's go ahead and open up the swatch booklet that came with our little mood box. And it looks like the theme for this issue is called Elevate Your Occasion Wear. So I'm just gonna read this little blurb here it says does your season seasonal style sway more towards relaxed barbecues than bayside brunches or are you in the throes of planning a fall wedding or constructing the couture collection you've been sketching out for months no matter what or when you're celebrating we've got something for you in this month's fashion-packed swatch box Create a sleek and modern suit dress with a textured brocade for a sophisticated look or whip up a breezy velvet wrap dress sure to catch the eye at your next event. So let's see what they have here. So there's 25 swatches in the mood swatch books. And we have... So the first one is a chevron fringe sequin fabric. It's in rose gold. It's 100% polyester. And it is featured in this book. It's page, let's see, page 9 through 10. Let's flip over to that page. And then I'm going to show you. So this is what they made with it. They made this. Um, it's pretty cool, actually. This... Is it? Most, it's mostly translucent, so you will need a lining. And it comes in these different colors, so it looks like a black and a white, kind of a silvery color, a, a ruby, an emerald, and a sapphire color. And the, like I said, the swatch I got is a rose gold. So let's go ahead and take a look at the swatch. It's really cool. Um, I have never sewn with sequins. I have sequin fabric. I haven't cut into it yet. Um, saving that until I feel a little bit more confident. This guy is $29.99 a yard. By the way, you can get 10% off at checkout if you use the code SWATCHBREAK19, all caps, no spaces, before well, too bad. Sorry. That code expired already because we are now September 1st. So it expired yesterday. My apologies. Um, my box only came about a week ago. So unfortunately, I didn't have a lot of time for that. Okay, so this is really pretty. I really like rose gold. So I, I'm a fan of this color. The, the emerald one and the sapphire pictured are pretty cool too. And again, I do want to mention that the pattern's featured, so let's take a look at the line art here. This is free. You can download this pattern free on mood.com. Let's go to swatch number two. And we're looking at a natural jute with glitter. Um, it's natural with silver glitter. It's jute and lorex, and it only comes in this one color way. It's not featured in the book. So let's take a look. This is kind of to me, like, <laughs> I'm just thinking of like festive burlap sack. I mean, it's got some sparkle to it. I personally wouldn't make anything out of it, though it is very interesting. Or you know what I, it'd be cute is if you made a, like a wine 
sack like a wine holder this is it'd be cute for that but it's probably way more well it's only ten dollars a yard so not too bad okay let's move on to swatch number three and what are we at now we are at metallic abstract embroidered tool and the color is navy blue it's 100 percent polyester there's three other colorways, though this one is not featured in our book. So let's go ahead and take a look. It is really, really cool looking. I love the like, kind of swirl looking lines and the color of this is a really pretty color. It's what they used to call it. Navy blue looks kind of like a grayish blue, um, but it's really cool. It's $24.99 a yard. Let's check the stretch here. There's some stretch there. Really awesome. I could definitely see using this in like a fuller skirt and a fit and flare dress. Of course you need a lining. Very cool. Um, too bad it's not featured in the book. So let's jump ahead to the next one, swatch four, it's a paisley and square striped silk chiffon. 100% silk. So far, I'm really digging this pattern. So let's jump to the page where it's featured. And they have made this cold shoulder dress with a high neck. I can't say that I enjoy this pattern. It's definitely not something that I would make, though it might be your style. Um, the Paisleys, it's in black, green, mustard, red, and brown. So those are the colors. I really do like this fabric, though, I must say. I think it would be a beautiful, long maxi skirt with lining. I love Paisleys. I think this is a great like transition fabric. I love silk. If you are interested in this cold shoulder pattern, you can download it at mood.com for free. So I'm gonna set this aside here. It's one of the ones that I really like. Okay, next up we have a lu lucidum. Bemberg lining in peacoat blue. It's 100% Bemberg. Comes in 30 different colors. They are featuring it in the magazine and we're going to flip to that page here. And we've got all these different colors. Let's make sure I get this in camera for you. So Bemberg is a is a very popular lining and with all these different colors you can find something for your next project that needs a lining. Um, Mood is asking $13.99 a yard. Some people don't really want to pay that much for lining. I know it's a little, you know, you're already spending money on your fabric and then you have to go and pay for lining. I get it. Um, but Bemberg is really popular, especially in jackets. It's got that um, sort of slick feel. So when you're sliding your jacket on and off, it's going to be really easy. This is 54 inches wide. Okay, and what did they make out of it? Oh, they're just showing you that they've used it as a lining in this particular dress. And this dress is kind of cool looking. If you look at the line art, it's got some cascading sleeves. And let's get a better picture. Can you see that coming into focus? There we go. Okay, let's check out, I think we're at swatch five. Watch, no, we're at five, watch six, excuse me. So here we go. We have a floral printed burnout jacquard, well, burnout organza jacquard. There's a lot of words in here. $24.99 a yard, 55 inches wide. Do we have some stretch? No, we do not have any stretch in there. And the colors, they call this load and Greek, green, pink and yellow. And it only comes in this one colorway. It's not featured in the book, but this is going to do well with with garments that are more structured. And one way I like to tell is I usually 
crumple the fabric and I see how it unfolds and you could kind of get an idea um, of how it would provide structure to your garment. So this is going to be better for a more structured garment like maybe a sheath dress or a pencil skirt, even a jacket. That would be great. Okay, moving right along, we are getting into a double cotton gauze. This is in quartz pink. It's 100% cotton. You can do so much with, dub with double gauze. I mean, it's, it's a very versatile fabric. This is $7.99 a yard, 55 inches wide. There's 25 different colorways. So if you are looking for a solid um, double cotton gauze, go to mood.com and see if there's a color for you. It is slightly sheer, well, slightly sheer. I, I can't really see anything. It could kind of make something out, but it's not terribly sheer. So just keep that in mind. And if you're looking for something really thick and opaque, this might be too light for you. Oh, next we have, <laughs> this looks like Swatch, the dog that lives at Mood. Um, this is Mood exclusive Dog Days Cotton Voil. It's 100% cotton. So as you know, Voil is a lighter weight cotton. And this one is $13.99 a yard. Width is 55 inches. And it's going to have French Bulldogs on it. Swatch the dog that lives at Mood in New York City is a French Bulldog. And the three times, four times, I think, that I've been to the shop, I have been lucky enough to see Swatch. He is a little sweetie. So it looks like um, in addition to the dogs, you have Kiwi, interesting, uh, Lemon, and some oranges. Let's try to get a picture here. Um, has some words there. I think this one says fake. And it says summer. This is kind of, it's kind of a very uh, whimsical, um, eccentric print. So you might want to pop on to mood.com and get a better look at uh, this print. It's too bad they didn't make something out of it. That would have been fun to see. Next, we have a metallic abstract luxury brocade. This one is in black and metallic pink. It's 80% polyester, 20% lorax. It comes in five different colorways, and I believe I have had this swatch, not this particular colorway, but this um, brocade in a previous swatch box from Mood. I really like it. I like the texture. I think this would lend itself very well to making a cocktail dress or a holiday dress just because it's got that nice um, metallic in it. And I like the pink and the black, actually. I like it a lot. And they made something out of it. Oh, it's page 15 through 16. Let's take a look. It's The downside of this guy is it's $49.99 a yard. It's 55 inches wide. 50 bucks a yard for fabric is a lot unless you're making a special dress. So if you're willing to splurge on a special occasion dress, maybe it's not so bad. I mean, if you consider, okay, think about it. If you were to buy a dress, com a commercially made dress, how much do you usually spend? If you're spending $100, $150, well, maybe it's not so bad, right? Okay, let's take a look. So there are these other colorways and I'm, you can kind of see it looks like there's a grayish kind, dark gray. It's hard to tell what co these colors are exactly, but there is a green, which looks beautiful, and a, and a dark navy. And I think I got that navy one before, or that or the green. Anyway, um, so yeah, the texture is a pebble. Like, it's kind of pebbly. And here's the back. You know the back's kind of cool, too. I could see using the back. Now you're definitely gonna wanna line this because this is actually like, it feels kind of scratchy. It's a, so it's not, it's not comfortable at all. You wouldn't want this against your skin unless you lined it. But I like this. I like the subtleness of the sparkle peeking through. Anyway, let's look at what they have made with it. They made this, it's like a blazer dress. Those were popular for recently, or they might still be actually. I think Vogue has a version in their fall lineup. Here's the pattern, free. I have to be honest, I have not found one 
pattern from Mood that I would actually download. I'd hate to say it. I know they're free, but I'm just, I just don't really like most of them. For myself, for myself. Okay. Next, we have a stretch velour with metallic floral foil. It comes in two different colorways, and this one is in pink, lavender, and black. It is very, very pretty. Very pretty. I, I love this. I am really tempted to buy it, but I'm afraid I'm just going to... Oh, it's only $18 a yard. I was expecting it to be like $29.99 or $39.99. Usually, that's what you're paying at Mood, but this is actually, you know super affordable for what it is and 57 inches wide so you've got some stretch of course because it's a it's a stretch velour so you can have stretch I just think this is really really pretty I'm moving it to the side as one of my favorites I wonder what the other colorway is I'll have to pop on and check it out 90% um, polyester and 10% spandex okay Next up, we were on Swatch 11, and we have an Italian stretch jersey crepe. I just bought some uh, stretch jersey crepe at Joanne, actually. It was like the 30% off sale plus an extra 20, and it was, and I paid $20 for four yards, so that was awesome. Though the quality isn't as nice as this one, though it was still decent. Um, this one is $15.99 a yard, 57 inches wide. It feels really, really nice. This is just a very nice, classic, chic fabric, especially if you're making clothes for the office, sheath dresses, um, just there's a lot you can do. And it's pants, crepe is a very versatile fabric. Three different colorways, 95% polyester and 5% spandex. Seriously, Mood, I swear, I feel like I keep seeing like repeats of swatches from previous boxes and I'm not really happy about that considering I pay $25 a month for this subscription box. <sighs> oh, Either that or I saw this when I was at Mood in July, who knows, but I really do feel like some of these swatches make their way um, through the boxes. Anyway, this is in a European geome geometric floral cotton poplin. It is cotton poplin. You can do oh, so much with it. Um, so there's two different colorways. It's not featured in our book. It is the fifteen ninety nine yard, fifty seven inches wide. And let me show you. I actually really really like this one. Let me show you a close up of the of the square. I think it's pretty cool. So poplin, as you know, it's crisp. I think a shirt dress would be really kind of cool out of that. A shirt dress with um, more of like gathered skirt. Okay. Next, we have a floral polyester heavy crochet lace, and this one. They have featured, let's take Yander, what did they make? Oh dear, I don't know if, um, I'm not a fan of this. What have they done? Um, I can't, I don't know. It's like, I have no words for this pattern. Anyway, I, let's just try to ignore that and just focus <laughs> sorry sometimes i'm not good at concealing how i really feel about something um this is white floral polyester heavy crochet lace 57 inches 9.99 a yard and i'm trying to see yeah that's the only color way they have it nice fabric all right moving along oh god sorry about that just gonna mess up my whole setting okay this one is really speaking to me i have i think i'm a bit of a hoarder when it comes to these tweeds especially when they have metallic shimmer i have like a whole cubby full of them and because i have all these grand plans to make these chanel style jackets of course um 
This one is really, really pretty. I love it. It is black with silver and silver sequins and some blue. It's just gorgeous. It's $24.99 a yard, 57 inches wide. And they did make something with it. Beautiful, beautiful. Let's go to 1920. Let's see what did they do? They made this little dress. I actually do like this dress. Um, for me, if it's going to fall that close to my behind, I would definitely lengthen it like a good four inches. But I like the silhouette. So if you look at the line drawing here, it's got short sleeves. It comes in. It's nicely fitted. It's, I could definitely see making a dress like this. And I'm going to put this to the side as one of my favorites from this box. Next we have we have geometric printed cotton twill. It's blue and white. It's 100% cotton and twill is going to be heavier because of the way it is woven. So as you can see, let's do my crumple test. See how it doesn't really pop out. It kind of maintains the crumple. So that is a character characteristic of twill. So consider that when you're picking your pattern. Um, let's see, 21, 22. They made shorts. And yes, twill is a great option for shorts. Let's check her out. Got that. And the pattern, of course, is available. It might pour it out of the way there. Yeah. Not a bad situation with this one. Okay. And this is the only colorway. So if you're expecting to get another one, that's it. Blue and white. Next, we have a Toulouse Mercerized Organic Cotton Voile in royal blue. I adore this color. It is one of my favorite colors, especially to wear. This is 100% cotton. It's $9.99 a yard and it's 57 inches wide. Um, I've probably said this before, but you know, wall is going to be more on the sheer side, so keep that in mind. It is a great fabric for um, lining when you're using natural fibers, especially if your main fabric is also a cotton, but it's, it's just a good option when you're using natural fibers for a lining. It comes in 10 different colorways. Okay. Moving along, we have a mood exclusive Fleur en Bleu, Fleurs en Bleu, okay, I, I took French, I tried to speak French, and I just mess it up, so let's just pretend, it's flowers and bl blue flowers is what it is in French, and this is $13.99 a yard, 57 inches wide, it's pretty cool, um, I'd like to see the entire print as a whole. But I love the um, this sort of olive-ish green um, with the dark blue. I think it those colors pair very well together. So if I show you, you could kind of see what the pattern looks like there. But that is a nice one. I think I'll move it to the side as one of my favorites. Next, we have a plaid polyester wool tweed. It's 95% polyester, 5% wool. Of course, this is going. This is a thicker fabric. In fact, it feels like a throw rug. <laughs> um, not quite as heavy. It's $19.99 a yard. It would be, of course, ideal for jackets and coats. It's, there's five different colorways if this doesn't um, make you smile. So it's it does feel nice. Like because of all the polyester, it's not going to be as scratchy as if you had like full on wool. Well, depending on the type of wool. Next up is a crushed velour. This is a, this color is called gray violet. Um, I'm not picking up any of the violet undertones or anything, but this is to me, this is like a dolphin color. It's beautiful. It reminds me of Quicksilver. It just looks like liquid. I love it. Um, 
97% cotton, 3% elastane, so you're going to have some stretch. Okay. We have 11 different colorways, and this one is on 23, 24, 23, 24, and it looks like I have a comment here from Andy. It says, she, it's a shame they didn't make things from more of the fabrics, but the box itself seems nice. I definitely agree with that comment. And I'm probably reading this comment at a delay because I'm seeing that my little broadcast is... There's a few, there's some seconds in delay. So I agree with you, Andy. 23, 24, 23, 24. Okay. This is a great fabric. So if you're looking for a velour, it's just very, very soft. And I'm loving the sheen. As you can see, they've got several different colors and we have like a white, kind of a brown, and I'm loving these blues. There's a, like a royal blue, more of a teal, and this looks more like a midnight. Can you see that? And then a ruby and a garnet. These are really, really pretty, and I've been thinking, because I'm on the Tilly and the Buttons obsession, that a long sleeve Agnes dress in a crushed velour would be really appropriate for the holidays. So I might have to look at one of these. Okay, let's move on. We're getting there slowly but surely. Oh, this looks like a comic book. I like these types of fabrics. I think they're really cool. I just, for me, I don't find them to be particularly wearable. Um, this one is called Mood Exclusive Fashionably Late Stretch Cotton Sateen. So it's 65% polyester, 35% cotton, and this snippet, there you go. That's what we get. So you should have some stretch on the, on the crosswise. And did they make anything with this? No, they did not. Too bad. Did I skip when I'm showing you the swatches? Did I skip what they actually made with that velour? I think I did because I just got so excited. Um, this dress, okay, this might be the first pattern I would consider downloading from Mood. I think it is beautiful, but again, I'm always wary of these wrap style bodices with these v-necks because I find them that they're just so low cut and I'm just, I just don't understand it. If anybody knows a wrap dress pattern that isn't crazy deep with the v, let me know because... I mean, yes, I can probably alter the pattern to, you know, fix that, but I just would like to know. Because when she's wearing it, it doesn't look like it's, it's really low, but it just seems so... But the line drawing is not mapping on to where that line is falling. Because this line looks like it's right under her bust. Like it's, like it's almost an Ampere waistline. But you look at it here, and it looks like there's going to be a much deeper V and that this is more at the natural waistline. So I don't know, maybe they altered this pattern somehow. Because they didn't want her boobs popping out. It just makes total sense. <laughs> okay, where are we? We are got five more to go. And we have an Italian double face double knit. I am all about these. I Ever since I came in contact with the double pr brushed poly, I'm just like knits, knits, knits. And I've been wanting to, especially double knits, because I love the um, how stable they are. So we have an Italian, I said that. <laughs> this is in blue mist and Moroccan blue. So it's kind of cool because it's really kind of reversible. So you have this blue mist and then you have the Moroccan blue. Both are gorgeous colors. And this is $17.99 a yard and it's 59 inches wide. This is a lovely, lovely fabric. There's four different colorways, so I'm gonna have to check that out. 25, see, when I do these swatch videos, it's so bad because it's like, I just spend more money and just end up hoarding more and more fabric that I don't need, but of course I want, okay? Um, oh, so here's the colors, they're beautiful. Um, the, the blue one is still my favorite. And they made this really cool Okay, I think I like this pattern too. 
that's great. I like the, it's, what is this? Is this a short? It's a short and it kind of looks like a skirt. And then there's this knit jacket with a tie. I think that is really nice and chic actually. Well done mood. You're getting there with your patterns. I approve. Okay, we are on 22, and this is a Mood Exclusive Palace Regatta Stretch Cotton Sateen. It's 97% cotton, 3% elastane, just like our little comic book girl here. Same type of fabric, just a different print. Um, it's more of a mid-weight type feeling, actually. 15.99 yard, 59 inches wide, and let me give you a close-up of the square so you could see it looks like it's just a repeat of like postcard snapshot looking things hard to tell on this camera here it's not focusing but do pop on a mood if you're interested and check out the prints if you need more detail next is a metallic liquid sheen polyester and it's a hundred percent polyester it comes in eight different colorways it is really Cool. Um, actually, $17.99 a yard, 59 inches wide. So on the really shiny side, it kind of like, it kind of grabs the skin. It looks like it would be kind of slippery. And um, it's not. It kind of grabs, but it's so cool. Isn't that neat? So I see that I have somebody that joined Lisa from Seattle. Hi, Lisa. Thanks for joining nice of you i love seattle that's one of my favorite cities gorgeous city one thing that when i see fabrics like this i think that um i would love to see that on a sleeve i just think i have all these visions of like sheer sleeves somehow or like puffy i love this i just want to sit here and just play with it all day but let's see, they did make something with it in 27, 28, and we can see the other color options that they have. Super cool. Um, so they did this gown with a draped neck in the back. I think that's really pretty. Here's the line art. It's not the best print on here, um, but here, you can take a look at her in her. This has to be lined clearly. Um, so you're going to see all your bits if you don't line it. But I think the, the cool thing about this, and there's all these different colorways. So you have like this uh, ivory with gold, and there's a pink and a sea foam, and more of like a gray silver, and it looks like a darker silver, and a black and gold, and a purple, and then a black. The thing is, is that you're, if you're going you're gonna have to be using a lining if you're making this on like a to cover your skirt for like a skirt or a bodice right um so think about it let's just take this just to show you so if you depending on what you put under it you can really um, have fun with kind of creating different looks depending on what you're using underneath so just because you're using an ivory here, doesn't mean you need an ivory lining. Just think about the different colors that you could pair with it just to give it like more dimension, more depth, change the color a little bit, make it more unique. Just something to think about. So I'm gonna put this to the side because I think it is really fun and you could do a lot with it. And I think we've only got two more swatches for this. Sorry, my little cord wants to just go everywhere. Next we have a metallic ultra stretch raised rib knit. It's 70% polyester, 20% lorax, and it's 10% elastane. Um, so you do have a lot of stretch because you've got that 10% elastane. And three different colorways. It's not featured in our book, but let's take a look at, you see the texture and how it is raised it's really pretty really neat fabric oh it's 21.99 a yard and it's 59 inches wide okay so we're moving on to our last swatch of the box so please do um, think about which ones you like 
and put it in the comment if you would like to talk about it. This one is a solid polyester satin and it's in vanilla cream here. And there's 36 different colorways. Um, wow. It's $8.99 a yard, 60% or 60 inches wide. I would not want to sew with this. I have sewn with this something like this before and it is an utter nightmare. At least it was for me. I just find that it slides. But this one seems a little heavier, so maybe not so bad. Let's um, take a look because I did feature it in the book. And we can see all the different colors that they they have. So that's, well, they made a cute little girl's dress. That's a very cute dress, actually. And she's very cute. So look at all of the colors they offer. I think if you're on the hunt for this type of fabric, you will not, you'll probably find the color you need here. Um, but it looks like, oh, we have this little picture of all the models together. You can see that there's too much glare. But yeah, that is it for this edition, the August edition of the Moods Watch Club. Um, go ahead, share with your with me your favorites in the comments if you want, and I'll just run through real quick um, my favorites before we end this video. So let's start with, we'll go back to the first one, which was this really pretty silk with the paisleys. That's really nice. Then we have this stretch velour with the metallic flowers. Really, really pretty. Next, I got this poplin with the geometric flowers. Just go here. I'll line them up. Maybe that's better. Then I have another, what is this? Is this a poplin? Yeah, it's a poplin with these flowers and stripes. I like the colors. I think it's kind of different. And then of course I have to include the tweed with the sequins and the metallic. And then I've got my double knit. Feels almost scuba-y. And then the velour. Not because of the color, because I don't think this color looks good on me, but I think this fabric is really great and a deeper tone would be best for me. And of course, this one. These, this is really fun. So let me know what your favorites were and if you think you'll be buying any from Mood. And I really hope that this live video went well. Um, it's my first time doing it. You can tell because I've got this cord hanging out here, so I'm really sorry. But next time it will be better. It's a learning process and I think it's fun to do the swatch box reviews live because I, um, I didn't get a lot of comments, but I think it will be a great discussion when we have more people to join. And I hope that this long Labor Day weekend you are getting some sewing in. It's the best time to sew when you have these long weekends and you could just sort of take your time, get into your project and really enjoy what you're doing. So thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. And please subscribe if you haven't already. Thumbs up the video if you like it. Feel free to share the videos, all that good stuff. And um, I appreciate it. I'll see you next time. Bye.